is our uh, Dickinson Family Education Conservatory. The plants that we can't grow outside that are unique and uh, to the tropics, we do grow inside. So that's a nice. really unique and special place. Hi, everybody. Excuse me. All right. <laughs> It's so sad because people can't see that, like, you're laughing or something. Oh, so exactly. I like that. Oh, thank <laughs> <Yeah>. you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Part of the reason why we exist is to inspire people to connect with plants and nature. And a lot of people, especially children, don't understand where their food comes from. And so, the, right now... That's our, so sad. It is very sad. Right now, our children's garden is closed to the public, but we have a little... Um, a little garden in the back there um, oh, that so it's called incredible edibles and it okay. shows again it shows kids where their foods grow like you know lettuce and yeah all these things so I know and even some even some adults they really have no idea like well doesn't it all just come from Costco exactly <laughs> Costco and, 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 and you know 7-eleven exactly exactly so it's kind of it's an education because when you really think about it you know, plants are foundational. We can't exist as human beings or any other form of life on this earth. We can't exist without without the plants that we have here. And everybody here's got their professional camera. You know, yeah, it's really it's, it's really fun. This is our California California gardenscapes. Um, these are natives, California natives. So a lot of times people will come to the garden also to just gain inspiration for what they can grow in their own backyards. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was thinking that when we were in that gazebo, like, oh, it'd be so cool to have like this, like, you know, sculpture or... Yes. Or... A lot of the plants in here will do well in your backyard because they don't require a lot of, you know, a lot of TLC because yeah. they're natives. Yeah. So like the, like the California right. poppies and the mallows and, and all of these aloes, it's done. So we're going to stop here. We're going to smell. Ooh. <laughs> it smells a little jasmine-y here. Oh yeah, right. It you smells can, good. It smells delicious, right? It's fabulous. This, this, you can smell it from 50 feet away. That's why it's so great to be in the garden.